Here's a fun little project for you guys today. This is an old one. This is one I made uh, almost five years ago. And I never recorded the process, so I figured I would uh, make a little video evidence of it today and show you guys what this is. This is actually a homemade reed switch pulse motor that I made. So if you take a look here, this is actually a reed switch, magnetic wire, which the rotor, which has magnets around the perimeter, will pull this reed switch in, activate this coil. This is just a 30 gauge magnet wire coil on a sewing machine bobbin. Thanks for the idea, lid motor. And this is pretty fun. I don't have any batteries right now. It runs off three volts, so I just have it hooked up to a wall wart. So this uh, is just one of the classic needle on the bottom of a screw bearing. Uh, not bad. Have come up with better bearing solutions since then. Also, this is a neon light. It's a 120 volt neon light. And it is able to illuminate that because of the collapsing magnetic field in this coil. Anyways, enough of that. Let's see what happens. So as you see, Runs quite nicely. Um, you can see the neon a little bit better if it's in the shade. Bring it up closer. There's the neon lighting. Very bright. Very hard to see that reed switch. It is just going crazy. Oh, pretty cool. I put the reed switch and the coil on Velcro so that I can move them around, play with the tuning, the speed, whatnot. So, pretty neat, works very well. This is another little reed switch pulse motor that I made. Much similar to this one, except for this is an actual store bought commercially available reed switch. And this is a little circuit board I made. Um, this also was about five years ago. This was uh, actually uh, dedicated to my buddy that passed. So, this one does run off of. Does run on a battery, so here is just a double day battery. I'll put this in here, and rather than the neon light, this one is lighting up LEDs from the collapsing magnetic field. Same concept. Well, this one also works very well. Two coils, 30 gauge magnet wire, same thing. Small rotor is just a couple caps with magnets on the outside. If I can get it on there. And there she goes. Anyways, a couple of fun projects uh, I want to go over. I have plenty more I'll make in uh, future videos. Thanks. Have a nice one.